Uh, welcome back. Today I'll be continuing from where we stopped previously and shall be looking at how to create content types in Drupal 7. Content type is basically a predefined collection of fields or data types which relate to each other. To create a content type, you go to structure, content types. So from here, we have two content types that come with Drupal. That is the article, which is basically information that is updated frequently, like news, resources, blog posts, and many more others. And then we have the basic page. This is basically for static content, such as about us page, as you can see. So to create a content type, you just click on add content type. So for example, I'll call it project and give it a description. And then here we leave this as default and then come to publishing options. We can just uncheck this and let it be published. And then go to the display settings. You can display author and date information or you can just uncheck this. So for us we shall uncheck this. And then we go to the com comment. We make it closed. Closed. And then menu settings. We can add it to main menu. And then save and add fields. So now by default, it has title and body fields. So you can add another field. For example, we have image. So you can just call it image. And so field image already exists. So what you do is you come down to existing fields. And then there's an image field right there. So you can get rid of this. So add an existing field, which is an image. Then field type, machine name is field image, and then the widget type is image. So you save. So upon saving, the label shall be image, and then we can make it required field. And then if there's a default image for your project, you can add it here. But for now, we have allowed file extensions, so we can have we have PNG, GIF, GPG, JPEG. So we can give a file directory and just call it project or just images. And then scroll down. Number of values is one. And then let's just save. Leave the rest as default and save. So now we have image added. So let's go back to structure content types. So here you can see that we have content type called projects however there's a spelling error so let's edit it projects and then save content type so we have content type called projects so we can manage fields and also manage display so we come here and make it hidden expand this and enable full content and then save so after that let's try to create content so you come here click on content add content and then we choose project so the title we give the project a title depending on what type of project you've worked on and then give it a body which is basically a short description so we shall just go to lorem and then generate content so just copy this first paragraph add it there then we can choose an image click on that click on upload and then you can provide a menu link for the project or you can just leave it unchecked then save so this is basically how to create a content type and also add content into it thank you so much see you in the next video